Hello friends, today I am going to share with you how you can bypass FRP lock on Galaxy J4 and Dart 8. So first of all we need to connect it with Wi-Fi. So I am just going to connect it with my Wi-Fi. So I just give here my password and then connect it with Wi-Fi. And you can see phone is connected with Wi-Fi. Now we need to plug USB cable and we need to open sam frp tool 3.0 in computer the link is in description you can download it from there so as you can see phone is connected now i select bypass frp open youtube click on it and this will show a pop-up message just click on the view button and you can see it's showing youtube update message so we need another method so stay tuned select internet browser and galaxy store now click on the bypass frp after installing it just open it and now you are in internet browser and just click on the more accept and continue now here search for frp facel from facelmobile.com so i just type here frp facel and search here you can see the first link just click on it and this will let you go to my website so here you just need to scroll down you just need to click on the technocare settings and click on the technocare settings to download it cancel the ad and now click on the technocare settings to download it it can take a few minutes depend on your internet speed so as you can see just download download started now now click on three dots downloads and here you can see it's downloading i just make it fast forward to download it fast after that you need to install it just click on it click next install it can take a few seconds to install it just wait a little bit now just click on the done button and go back go back again go back to the facelmobile.com and here you need to click on settings app and now you are in mobile settings so just scroll down and select security tab and other security settings device admin apps and find my device should be deactivate now go back again and apps and here we need to disable the google play services so just scroll down and find google play services here it is google play services just click on it and you need to disable it now you need to go back again and click on the cloud and accounts here it is click on accounts add account now click, click on google and here you need to give your gmail id and password you can give any gmail id and password over here so i am just giving my gmail id over here and then i will give my password so this is the gmail id click next and now I will give my password and click next now you can see account is logged in click agree it can take a few seconds now account is added here so we are almost done now click on apps and enable the google play services which we disabled before and now 
go back and click on security and other security settings device admin apps now find my device should be activate so that's all now we are almost done here now you can restart your mobile or you can go back to the home screen whatever you want i just restart my mobile and i just make it fast forward for you so we can finish it fast now you just need to set up your mobile and frp lock will be gone so if this method works for you you need to comment in the comment section with the date so other people also can get help hopefully this method work for you and this method also works on other samsung devices which have android 7 or android 8 or if you are facing youtube update message you can use this method so hopefully it will work for you but don't skip the video there is one step left which is also very important so keep watching video till the end Now you can see our phone is started up successfully, there is no FRP lock or Google lock. Now you can use your mobile freely, but there is one step left. So just go to the apps and you need to uninstall the Technocare settings, otherwise your mobile will not work properly. So I am just going to apps and here we find Technocare settings trick and we need to uninstall it so it must be uninstalled otherwise phone will not work properly so you can see i am just going to uninstall it it can take a few seconds so it's uninstalled now you need to go back and all is done Hopefully you like the video, if you like the video do subscribe, like and share. See you in the next video, till then bye bye.